kindly subscribe to Focus Academic Solution YouTube channel. Alright, today we'll be discussing on how to measure a triangle with a protractor. You can see the triangle is having three angles, and we, and we know that some of an angle in a triangle is 180. The triangle is having three sides. You can see the side A and the side B, side C of the triangle. Sum of an angle in a triangle is equal to 180 degrees. That is the addition of the angle A, B, and C should be equal to 180 degrees. So that's what we'll be getting through our protractor now. Okay, we, we've talked about the angle of um, A, B, and C. Now, I want to use the protractor to tell us how we can measure this angle to be equal to 180 degrees. You can see on my protractor, you place it on the right, on the 90 degree of the protractor here. All right. You're going to have it this way. So you make sure the point is at on the point of the protractor. See, I can measure from this place. Now, I'm having 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. And I'm having the line exactly on what? Um, okay, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, on what? 63. So the angle B is equal to 63 degree. So if I want to measure the angle A, the angle A, I'll be having it on, let's say again, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 62. Angle A is what? 62 degree. Why the last angle which is what angle C? Angle C. Okay, all right. Let's see. I'm having 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. That's, let's say, 50. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50 is on 57 degree. 57 degree. So I will say that some of an angle in the triangle should be equal to 180. So summation of all these angles, so A plus B plus C, I'll be having 62 plus 63 plus 75. Summation of all these angles here should give us an 182, 182 degree. You can see that the rough I'm getting is almost equal to 180 because due to what my diagram the angle so i'm always having exactly what 182 degree which is also equal to what 180 degree that is we can use our protractor to get exact angle in a triangle thanks for watching thanks subscribe to our channel